Yeah, this is mostly for interactive work. The value mm -hmm. proposition here being that you can interactively ask, I want the trace to start only now while something's running. You don't need to start the Julia compiler, sorry, the Julia session with uh, the tracing being enabled. You don't need to wait through thousands of lines of unrelated trace messages. You can just uh, interactively decide when to, tra the, when to trace and only that part is being traced. Yeah, a, a really good use case for this would be like, you know, if you're, you know, you did all your pre-compilation tool stuff and you see like, okay, I compile, but then the second compile, the, the second run also still has a compile compilation. Just can't figure out why. Like what what is actually being compiled in the second run, right? Um, it, I guess if you can compile the first one, then you can flip the, the switch and then you can do the second run and you can see what's, what's compiled this, only the second time, right? Um, and that can help isolate exactly what the problem is, uh, problematic uh, methods are. 